time to head over to the Beko kitchen because we love being here and <laughs> spread out in front of us is all the ingredients. A bit of a UK treat. Yeah, this is this is a classic from the homeland. This is the Cornish pasty. Okay, good. I've I've only bought them. I've never made them. I've never seen them over here. Okay, actually. so what what ingredients have we got here? We're going to use a bit of oh, swede. Swede, yeah, yeah, that is, and that's the classic ingredient in there. So we've got potatoes, swede, onions. So it's really, really simple, but I mean, it's it's going to be the best pie you ever taste. And that's a big call for New Zealand. Uh, okay, right, okay, we, <laughs> we got up back to the tears. We've got some rump steak as well, yeah. and uh, I'm going to show you how to make the pastry. Wrap it up. Got some techniques mm. for uh, crimping it and baking it. This is brilliant. Oh yes, I cannot wait. It's going to be sensational. Great to have you with us. We're in the Beko kitchen, and today we are creating an English institution. <laughs> I didn't know it was an English institution. It is. It's a pasty. So we're going to get stuck into it, aren't we? <laughs> Cornish pasty, yeah. Right, so first of all, we need to make the pastry. Okay. Okay, flour. Right. So we're making the pastry from scratch too. We this are making great. the pastry I from like scratch. This. Yeah, yeah, so it's really, so it's dead easy. Okay, good. But, uh, Do you need a special type of pastry for your pasty? Uh, yeah, this one. Okay, good. <laughs> the one that has so far flour and butter. <laughs> flour and butter, so okay. cold butter, chopped up, salt. Salt. A little bit of mustard powder. Okay, is that your little secret recipe, it's is little, it? little secret there, and nice. a bit of baking powder as well. Okay, good. That goes in there. Nice. All right, and we're going to uh, put two yolks in there. Okay. So just crack these. Get those in there. Did and then we're going to whiz that Did you have a good all. weekend, mate? You're on fire. You're just like right in there today. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I did have a good weekend, actually. Oh, good. Hanging out with the girls. Hanging out with the girls. Right, so blend that around. Yes. And then that wants to resemble fine breadcrumbs. Okay. okay. And then we've got some cold water here. Yes. And we're going to add that in to bring it all together. Okay, so you've got to wait until that looks like the breadcrumbs. Yep. Okay. It's getting there slowly. So, yeah, so slightly. You've still got some big, um, big nuggets of butter in there. But just, you know, a little bit more. Take a couple of minutes to do this uh, okay. stage. But for the sake of television, we're going to speed this up slightly. <laughs> yeah. And then you're going to add, add a little bit in. Okay. And then just, you know, pop it in, let it go around, let all that water incorporate into it. You can add a little bit more. You know, sometimes you might need a little bit more water or a little bit less, so it's okay. always pays to sort of add it in, get it in, and just, just enough now so it's to... Uh, <laughs> Move it all around, yeah. Sounds like it's going to die on us. <laughs> It's working hard. Right, so we'll just we'll give it a little little bit of helping uh, hand. Helping hand, right. yeah. Okay, good. And then once it all comes together. This is exciting. Or nearly comes together, you can tip it out. Yep. And with a little splash. So you can see it's getting it's getting larger now. Yes, it's starting to look like pastry. There you go. Okay, good. And then oh, oh, are we gonna need it? Well, we're just going to bring it together. Okay, cool. So you can you can pop it on here. Yeah. You all right? You all right? Yeah, 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 you happy with good. how things are progressing? Uh, yeah. It's all, it's all about adapting in the kitchen. Good, good. And, then, and this is what we do. You just sort of bring it together now. So you can see that's really soft there, but yeah. it's not there. It's just not um, mixed very well. Okay. But that's fine because we can tip it out and then we can sort of knead it in and then we nice. can sort of, you know, see exactly how... Um, <laughs> are you just making like this up? Is, are you making this no. up as we are going? No, this okay, fine. Good. <clears throat> right, no, but so, this is yes, well, that's what we that, need. Yeah. Okay, we don't but need that. Is, no, but this is the, this is what's going to happen at home as well. So I'm just going <laughs> just to show you. Right, and then that, yeah. and then just knead it a little bit so it all comes together. Yeah. You know, and then uh, don't worry about those. Bits. <laughs> don't worry about the bits on the ground. Good. No, no, and then and there's, and there's your pastry. Right, so wrap it up. Good. Uh, wrap it up tightly in cling film. Pop yep. it in the fridge for about an hour so it rests. Good. Well, that turned out right actually. Every time we did that. And look, here's one we made oh, earlier. Look. look at that. Yay! Nice that's why I'm not too worried about. Ah, oh, okay, sweet. <laughs> right, so that so that's your pastry. So that's rested. Okay, there cool. it is. You know, it's it's um, oh, yeah, cool. it's quite spongy, but it's quite stretchy. You okay, know? Yep, And that's yep. what we want because okay. we're going to be wrapping it. Great. Right. So that's ready to roll out. So we're going to roll that out in a minute. Yes. Right, and we're going to so we're going to prep the vegetables now. So potato. You put a potato in a pasty. Yeah. Okay. Traditional fear going it. on here. Actually, I'll, I'll get you to okay, good. Make me do something. Potato. Okay. Swede, right? So this is traditional. Mm -hmm. So I, th I think it's sort of, you know, it's it's uh, it's one of those old sort of recipes for the miners, right? So it's all about the pastry. You know, I think they just sort of got whatever they've got or whatever they had lying around, threw it in a pasty, wrapped it in pastry. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> this is just one of those days today, isn't it? <laughs> All right, so so if that ever happens, this is how you peel a potato with a knife. <laughs> Soften tail, and then uh, and then just go around, just like an orange. 
<laughs> okay. And if you, you know, if you get a little bit too much potato on, you know, throw it in the oven, do potato skins. Oh, They're no, really good. Go. we're not wasting food. No, no, we don't waste food. And, Chish, you're um, very efficient when we muck up, Mark. Can I just exactly. say that? You've got an answer for every situation. <laughs> I love it. Someone's like, it's happened before. <laughs> right, so same with the Swede. Take that off. And then what you want to do is... Oh, God, that was a bit too much. And then we're just going to chop it into like little little pieces. Oh, so I it's very it's sweet. very rustic. Okay, good. Right, that goes in the bowl. Yes. You can give that a good season. Okay, good. <laughs> See if I can muck this up. <laughs> okay. yeah. And then we're going to do the same with the potato, and we're going to peel an onion as... Oh, God. <laughs> we're going to do... We'll come gonna... back very soon here in the Beko kitchen where our pasty is going to be amazing. Maybe we take a quick little break while we catch up with Holly. OK, things are under control. Still to come, we'll get to enjoy the sounds of one of my favourite artists ever, Tammy Nelson. She shares her new album with us right now, though. Here she yes. is. I actually think you guys need some help. <laughs> so true. Okay. Right. Have you ever had a pasty before? I have. I'm Canadian, so it's that same British Commonwealth. Ah, thing. damn nice. <laughs> nice. Have you oh. <laughs> Pull the wool I over your eyes. That <laughs> better be real. Um, have you made one from scratch before? Are you kidding me? Yeah, no. Do I look like I spend a lot of time in the kitchen? No. Not with that amazing dress on. And if anything gets on this, you guys are in trouble. We're in trouble. It. Okay, cool. <laughs> uh, right, well, you right. can help with the, the salt and pepper then. That I can do. All right, you can <laughs> do, do that. that. Yeah. What, so we've got potato, onion, and sweet, and sweet in, in that. Yeah, so we're going to give that a good salt and pepper. Okay. Oh, let's do it. In there. Let's Mix do this. it around. I've got, uh, got some. Uh, rump steak here, which are just sliced nice and um, nice and small. This is what? You want the yeah, seasoned yeah, too, Season that as well. Oh, see, this right. makes In much there, easier I've work. got a little bit of flour. Yeah. So that's just going to coat the um, steak. I've got some mustard as well going in there. You can give that a good stir around. Some okay, mustard. Don't get it on mustard. your sleeves. And that's... Okay. Uh, These ABBA sleeves are not made for the kitchen. That's a great dress. <laughs> They're just made for From being that. wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> And it looks good on your album Fabulous. cover. Sassafras, that is such a good album, by the way. Thank you. We'll talk about that more soon, <laughs> otherwise now we'll feel left out. And then we get a little bit of uh, parsley, which we're just chopping up as well. That goes in, in with the beef. Okay. Yeah. So that's cool, all right. And then... And a the pasty is usually I've got a little beef. bit of... Uh, yeah. Okay. A little, little bit of... A little bit of uh, stock in there. Okay, cool. Just to moisten it up. But the reason why we put the flour in, yes. as the beef cooks and the, and the stock, the moisture comes out and the flour will just hold it and almost make like a, a little jus around it. A gravy. A little bit of gravy around it. Do you cook much in the kitchen? Do I? Like, yeah, okay. in my face. <laughs> I'm just, I'm sleeping with my eyes open right now. I'm just, until it's ready to eat. Are you the, yeah, yeah, don't talk to me. I am yeah. there when it's ready to eat. <laughs> All right. So we've got our pastry, so we've rolled that out. Get a plate, cut it out so it's nice and uh, you get nice and round. I like that idea. And then all we need to do now is take your vegetables and we're just going to, you know, put some vegetables there in the centre. Okay, it looks quite chunky, this pasty. Yeah, that's, that's <laughs> what it's supposed to be, Mike. Okay. And then we put the meat on top. Oh, nice and quick too, once you've got okay. through the preparation stage, isn't it? That's it. <laughs> and then a little, this is a secret, a little knob of butter in there. Oh, he oh. loves his butter. About the butter flavor. is always the secret. Exactly. Right, I've got an egg in here, so I've just whisked it up. So a little egg wash, that goes around the pastry, and that's going to stick it all together. Right, and then we want to lift it up. Oh, so this where you get to crimp it? Yeah, join it in the middle. Okay. So the secret as well here is not to overfill it and right. be greedy. Okay, but we can, get, we can get a bit more in. Get as much as you can get oh, in he says that. without overfilling it, all right? There's a very fine line. Mm. And then just give it a rough, uh, you know, crimp so it's all together. So this is looking a bit there. greedy. Is it, it is looking greedy? a bit greedy. No, 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 that's no, like that's me good. after a chocolate cake trying to zip into my dress. <laughs> and then what, what you want to do is crimp it together yeah. and then fold and then crimp again. So, cr so put it together, fold, yeah. crimp. Ah. Fold, crimp, fold, crimp, and you go all the way along. Okay, so, so you make, you're making it, you know, nice and secure, nice and tight. A little bit of flour on your fingers if it's a bit wet, and you're sealing that in. Nice. So that's really okay. the difference between a pie and a pasty, isn't it? It's all to do with the crimping. It's the crimping. It's the and crimping. That's a little bit more to it. Okay, okay. <laughs> and then, uh, and then so egg wash, same, same egg wash. <laughs> this is like a national dish. <laughs> okay. I get disowned from the UK. Sacrilege, <laughs> <laughs> make this right. And then egg wash all over. And then um, 
couple of little steam holes just right. on top, just a little bit. Oh, yeah. And that goes on there. It goes in a hot oven about 180 degrees for about 40, 50 minutes. And so it's nice and golden, pastry's cooked, and all that flavor and meat and vegetables yeah. is nice and tender. And that is going to be the best pie you've ever is, had. Is this the Pasty. part where you pull it out and we eat it? Or? No, we've got no, to we're going to check you out. <laughs> <She's gone. laughs> I'm out of here. <laughs> right, she's out of here. We'll go and rescue her back very soon and have a chat. Hope you enjoyed this. You can get the recipe at thecafe.co.nz. If you make any of our dishes, please share them on our Facebook page. Yeah. Yeah. Good work, Tammy. Well done. Yeah, we done a good Thank job. you. Thank you. That's my first what are you one. cooking tomorrow? Right, tomorrow I've got a Persian lamb tagine. Oh, yum. Yeah.